Right then, so this is the JF 100 RS Crystal CPU cooler from Joy Shark. Sorry if I pronounced that incorrectly, but it does support LGA 1500, 1200, 1700, AM4, and AM5. So it is their most latest one. And as you can see, it's a 10 centimeter side blown CPU radiator. This is from China and what we'll do is have a nose at what's inside the box Ooh. Uh, greatness in sim simplicity back to nature so, right. so it comes with step-to-step -step instructions which are hmm. oh, what's that that's a, oh, a certificate Oh, inspector. And, right, so this is what the this is, and that is what it says. That is what it looks like. So it doesn't. So it does utilize the back plate, which is actually good. So this is for AMD, and I'm assuming this is for Intel. There we go. So that comes with all the brackets that you need. So, okay, as in terms of brackets, it does come with a Intel bracket. This is right here, that's the Intel, so it's very similar to what uh, <coughs> Thermalright's been doing. This is for a M4, and as you can see, yeah, it doesn't come in all thermal paste, unfortunately. Would have seen what a nice would have been nice to see a little bit of thermal paste on there. Now grab this. Oh look at that. I actually like that. It's like brushed aluminium top of it. So here we go. So ooh. Oh wow. Ooh. Look at this. Oh wow, this is cool packaging. Oh, oh whoa, look at that. Now that looks gorgeous. And yes, it does have a please remove sticker. Yes, it isn't like a bottom plate, but that doesn't matter. Wow. I like the top end, that's very nice. Uh, it's, I don't like those clips. So, there are the fins, there's the fan, it is ARGB, and as you know, I love my ARGB. So, it's a standard ARGB connector, oh, and look, 4-pin PWM. There's, there is a bit too many, many cables here. Oh, wait there, I know why there's so many cables, because the top part of there glows. Oh, so similar to, um, what, Montec do. So, it is a daisy-chained AHV connector and it's got this horrible little three pin. I do not like these, but that is the cooler. Wow. That actually looks really nice, doesn't it? I will say it's not that big. But the overall look of it is rather catching. I really like this aluminium top. It looks really nice. Now let's have a look. Take these fans off. Okay. Okay, so there's the fan. Those annoying clips. Oh, so it's attached to that. That is a look more of a look at the fin density. So this is just a cover. Yeah, just a cover. Yeah, so I'm assuming yeah, it's probably there. Right, so this is a so it is a 12 volt fan and it doesn't say anything else. Hmm. Well, I hope you enjoyed that little unboxing of the Joy uh, Joy Shark JK100 RS Crystal. So, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Bye!
Okay, and guys, what do you think? Well, this little uh, cooler is quite striking. Uh, I do overall like the build quality, and of course, this is just the unboxing, but this is obviously you saw it in the case, but that is what it looks like in the system, fully built. Now, I will say that I will be testing this with the 5900X to see if this small little air cooler can control that, because my 5900X, I have seen it reach up to 175 watts. So, yeah. <laughs> um, I'd like to say a big thank you to Joyshark for sending out three coolers, because, yes, I've got another three coming. I've got this one, by here. This big one, and then I got uh, this one. So, yeah, more unboxings coming, guys. Hope you guys have a fantastic day. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. And this is Rich Welsh Tech. Goodbye.